Saturday, April 22nd, 1.15 p.m. New York time. We're going to look at here the FANG Plus stocks, stock indexes, and the stock sectors. Changing it up here, I'm going to start off with the FANG Plus stocks. We'll look at the weekly charts. Each candle represents a week. Looking here at the one-year chart. Again, one-year data, data. This is Apple. That's a stock symbol top left. The Apple is in several stock indexes. It's in the NASDAQ 100. It's in the Dow Jones. It's in the S&P 500. Not all stocks are in these big indexes, nor are all stocks in multiple indexes. So for the week, it closed red. It did make a higher high, higher low than the prior week. It made a new high for the year. It's trending. That's leadership. The candle that formed, it's bearish, a bearish pin bar. Look, there was one here. And what happened? It reversed. Doesn't always happen. Sometimes it would go up and reach chest near the top of the till before it reversed. Sometimes it would go higher a little bit, or maybe a day or a few days, and then roll over. That's why you look for triggers, and then you look, including the setup. Yep. Still, Apple is below the high of last year. Microsoft. Yep. Just below the high of the year. Huge consolidation. Just shy of the high of the year. Closed red. Amazon. Close green, higher high, higher low. It's also broke out of this consolidation. Let me label that as consolidation. Meta, red, just shy of the high of the year. Google, green, look at that, trending lower, broke below that inside candle. It's still an consolidation. Tesla. Red, lower low, lower high, breaking below this consolidation. Just shy of testing this prior midpoint. Yep. So there's a high of the year. It's been making lower highs. And this big trend sell-off, that was a retracement. It filled. Consolidation, breakdown, consolidation, breakdown. Does it need to have some help explaining? Let's draw a little line to show you. The overall trend is here. It'll open up for three years. Yep. It's been trending lower highs for three years. It's not leadership. Nvidia, new high for the year. Nice. Netflix broke down below this consolidation. Consolidation, trend down, retracement, consolidation, breakdown. Still weak. Alibaba, oof. Yeah, huge trend down. Retracement, impulse move. Retracement, selling off still. So those are the Feng Plus stocks. Very few of them making new highs for the year. But again, the ones that are, we should expect. That's where the leadership is. It's not Tesla. Let's go to the next look at the major U.S. stock indexes. The biggest one that's used as a guideline for mutual funds, pensions, institutions, is the S&P 500. 500 are the largest publicly traded companies. The S&P 500 is comprised of several indexes. The NASDAQ 100, the Dow Jones Industrial Average, the Dow Transports, the Dow Utilities, and the S&P 100 are inside the S&P 500. Got it? Not the Russell 2000. That's separate. So all these stocks are in each of these other indexes, not only in those indexes, but also in the S&P 500. Well, look at here. It closed red. Yep, just shy of the high of the year. Hit a higher high, higher low. Look at that. Bearish pin bar. Similar to like Apple. Look at that wedge, those blue lines. In that wedge was what? Building a coil. Getting tighter and tighter. Broke above it, rejected it. 
Yeah. Let's put this back for three years. Similar. Yep. Getting the momentum here. Still tight. NASDAQ 100. Interesting. Mm -hmm. Just shy of making a high for the new year. It's an exhalation. Just like I mentioned. Where this S&P 500 broke out of the exhalation. Higher, high, higher, low. So it's trending better than the NASDAQ 100. Yep. The NASDAQ 100 had a lot of tech, tech stocks that sold off this past week. You see that also in the video I posted yesterday on the Dow 30. This the Dow Jones Industrial Average inside candle. Hmm, interesting. Indecision, solid body equivalent to a red. Let's put this back for three years. Similar to the S and P. Let's look at the Nasdaq. The Nasdaq for the past three years. Look at that. A lot of similarities. Hmm. The Dow transports higher, high, higher, low broke above the consolidation. Yep. Still. It's in a retracement mode. That prior sell-off, it hasn't even tested that midpoint. Still struggling. Let's put this back for three years. And the Dow Utilities inside candle. Couldn't even take out the high last week. Put it back for three years. Wow. Interesting. Yep. And the Russell 2000, small caps, small caps in a tight solution here. So again, a lot of them haven't even made midpoint yet of those big sell-offs, right? A lot of them are struggling. Interest rates go higher, hurts the Russell 2000 much more than the other bigger cap stocks. Let's go look at the 11 stock sectors. 